Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Lock Your Learning. In this video, we are going to solve ICSE Mathematics Class 8, Chapter 40, Factorization Exercise 14, Equations 17 to 20. See the 17th question. We have 25p square minus 1 by a by 9. This is 1 by 9, right? Not 1 by a. Now see here, this will be what? 25p square can be written as square of 5p clear and minus 1 by 9 can be written as 1 by 3 whole square okay because 5p whole square if you will open up you will find 25p square and 1 by 3 whole square if you will open up you will also find 1 by 9 now bring it to the original form now your answer will be ready 1 5p minus 1 by 3 into 5p plus 1 by 3 clear that's your final answer now come to the next part okay you have in the 18th question what 16a square upon 25b square minus x square upon 100 clear now see this is what you have very clearly first term if you see you can write first term as the square of 4a upon 5b So 4a can be written as 16a square 20, uh, and 5b whole square that will be giving you what? 25b square, okay, when you open the bracket up. Now come to the second term, x square can be written as square of x and 100y square can be written as 10y whole square, right? So if you will open this, x square will give you x square, 10 square will be 100, y square will be y square only. So this is what you have now, solve it. 4a upon 5b minus x upon 10y into 4a upon 5b plus x upon 10y. Fine, that becomes the answer. Now let's move on to the next question. See the 19th question. This is minus 36 plus 1 upon 49m square. Again, bring it to this original form. I can write this minus 36 plus 1 upon 49m square as 1 upon 49 m square minus 36 i have just changed the order so 1 upon 49 that means 1 upon 7 okay because 49 is the square of 7 and m square is the square of m minus 36 36 is the square of which number 6 so here you will have 6 square now further simplify this you will have 1 upon 7 m minus 6 1 upon 7 m plus 6 which becomes your final answer you can write it as m upon 7 it doesn't matter okay it's the same thing now see the 20th question 4 by 9 p square minus 25 upon 36 q to power 4 very simple see 4 4 is the square of 2 and upon 9 is the square of 3 p square is the square of p 2 by 3 p whole square we have written it like this right now see here what you will have minus 25 is the square of 5 36 is the square of 6 q to power 4 is the square of q square now put it here whole square right now we will have what 2 by 3 p minus 5 by 6 q square in one bracket and in the other bracket we will have 2 by 3 p plus 5 by 6 q square right that is our final answer all right and friends this is all for today if you are new to my youtube channel do not forget to subscribe and leave a like on this one till then take good care of yourselves and bye bye